Hi all, and welcome to T-Shirt Talk, where I chat about T-shirts that I own and where I got them from, concerts, etc. Today is one of my all-time favourite bands. Um, going back in the early 90s, I discovered these. There was, uh, when I was at working, when I was working, there was, uh, right opposite where I was working, there was, there was this uh, metal work store, and I remember there was, there, was, there was two guys in there I knew really well, and um, they, they used to play rock and metal and all sorts of eclectic stuff. But I remember once there was this, there was this noise coming out of it. They're like ferocious, gargling, gurgling vocals of demonic, like sickening style of, oh, I don't know what you describe it, but so evil and so sort of retching sounding. And I was like, what's that? <laughs> I was like, wow. I mean, at this point, I was... Um, I was I was I was getting into metal. I was quite into it, but I was learning more and more bands, and um, these were like a new level of, of of stuff which I'd never ever heard before. And um, basically, it's obituary. And um, this is a quality. It's the iconic artwork of their logo, really, and it's just so good. I, I love a obituary's logo. They've done several different types of it. This is like a stripped back black black and green what version, but their the original logo is um, that I think is that's their early logo. It's like metal you can, on the on the on the artwork there is like metal, and it's supposed to be sharp metal, and then underneath it you've got like blood coming down. But um, it's such a great logo, and and um, I love how it's. It's kind of like, it's like sort of like an oval. Um, it's just so good. And this this is when I met them. I met, I've met Obituary three times, which is just like stunning. Like, you know, I met them at, um, I think I met them at Bloodstock twice. I can't. And then I, I met them um, on this tour. Now this was from 2018. This was uh, when they played with Slayer, which is why I've got this one on. This was a, this was a Christmas present. I didn't. It was just a gift of my missus Denise. She knows I love Slayer, so she got me this. Now I love this shirt because it's, it's uh, a bit unusual. You don't see it all that often. It's a bit macabre at the bottom, but um, it's a great shirt. Um, so there's no back print on this, but it's, it's like I say, it's unusual. It's not. I don't know where it's from. I don't. It's not off an album cover. I don't know where it's from, but it's a fantastic piece of art. I love it. And, it, and like I say, it's unusual. So basically, Slayer were touring in 2018. They played their last um, set of gigs, which went on for a couple of years, I think. And they called it a day. Now, it was a big thing. They had a great set of bands going on. There was um, So there was Obituary. They kicked it all off. And then there was um, Anthrax and then Lamb of God and then Slayer. And I saw Slayer twice on this tour. I saw them in Birmingham and I saw them in Newcastle because I thought this is the last time I'm going to go. I'm going to go up and I'm going to go to Newcastle. And I had some friends up in Newcastle. So, um, so, so that was quite cool. So I went up to Newcastle and saw my friends. I went to Birmingham. I went, uh, now I knew quite a few people going to the, to the Birmingham gig, but I went on, I went on my own. I, I got the train up and, um, I got up, I got up there about 12 o'clock. I had a couple of beers in Birmingham. Birmingham's quite a busy place, so just popped into a, a, a nice pub, which sold a couple of nice ales, because I do like my beers, like my ales, and I had a couple of beers, and then I actually bought, I bought the um, the meet and greet package, now I don't always do this, and I'm a little bit divided on it, um, it was quite cheap, so it was it was good price, and, um, and you got the t-shirt thrown in, you also got a cap, I mean this cap was like, 25 30 quid so a bit cap again got the logo on it. it's classic classic logo camouflage it's got like a net in type back which is neat so i got that i got the t-shirt which was i don't know if this was 25 or 30 was it some of them were 30 i think the slayer ones are 30 and um i got some guitar picks and i got a, a poster and a laminate and i think there was a couple of other little bits i can't think what they were now but i think it might have been like a mock plastic pass you know so and i got to meet the band i was spent quite a bit of time with them with them for like 20 odd minutes chatting 
and uh, it was only there was only three of us. It was awesome. So, like I say, yeah, a little bit divided on on the old um, meet and greet packages. I mean, like I think if if you love a band, this is just like my thoughts. If you love a band and it's a decent price and you get some stuff chucked in, like I did, you know, I got this t-shirt and and the and the cap and all that. I think it's great. It's worthwhile. But when you're sort of just meeting, you know. A band and, and and you don't really get much for your money, and you don't get any you know any gifts or anything like that or stuff, or you might even only get two minutes from it, especially if it's, they're, they're more popular and um, there's a lot of people queuing up like you know. But in in this situation, I thought it was bang on. And um, what I did was I took all my CDs with me and I got them all signed. So this is uh, the first one. Slowly we rot. And what they've done is all the members signed it. Actually, this was—I didn't actually get them. No, just remembered. Sorry. This I'm this I got this one signed at Bloodstock. So, but all the other ones were signed by the artists that, that sorry, the, the band members that played on it. So that's pretty cool. So, this is uh, Cause of Death. Now, Cause of Death. This is actually used by. Uh, it's on a cover of a book, H.P. Lovecraft's book, um, Lovecraft's Nightmare A. This was the artwork that they used on it. And this artwork was originally penned for Sepultura's Beneath the Remains um, album cover, cover, but it didn't get used. And I'm not sure why. There was I don't, I don't know um, whether something wasn't quite dealt with, but, but uh, Igor, the, the drummer for Sepultura, I think he had a tattoo of this on his arm, and he was not happy that it got used for obituary. There was some some details which I'm not 100 percent sure on, but but uh, it was it was something like that. Um, crazy, really. So, but being fantastic. Well, I mean, the artwork's incredible. And then you've got um, uh, the end complete, which is just fantastic. I love I love the is this sort of darkness of it, and that's all signed as well. This is uh, back from the dead. Again, that's signed and that's cool. And then I got. The anthology, which is not signed, and then one of their later albums. Uh, this is what's inked in blood, I think. Yeah. So this is just a basic cover, but it's um, it's all signed and and well, it's got the cardboard sleeve, which is neat. And then uh, we've got this is a self-titled album, which is 2017, is it? Yeah, 2017. This one, um, which is good. It's embossed. I like that. And then inside is uh, the band members, and, and they've signed that as well. So I think I've got about six signed, I think, which is no, really good. Um, so Abitra, yeah, I've always been a fan of them. Since I first heard that noise, that sound, that ferociousness. I mean, John Tardy is my favourite vocalist. I don't know about all time, but he's high up of all time, for, for my opinion. But he's without a doubt my favourite death metal vocalist. He's just so, his voice is so demonic. It's like listening to a horror film in a way. Like, you know, um, he's got that sort of voice and it's so good. And he, the good thing is, like, he's still got, he's still got great sound now. Even today, like, you know, on the obituary, they formed in 1984 uh, in Tampa, in Florida. There was some other bands, some amazing bands that came from Florida. They first were called Executioner, and I think that had two different types of spelling. And then I think it was about 88, they, they became obituary. And, um, but there was also um, other bands such as Death, Deicide, uh, Monstrosity, Atheist, and Morbid Angel that came from um, Tampa in Florida. And other bands, like um, other American bands like um, Malevolent Creation and um, Cannibal Corpse, they, I mean, Cannibal Corpse came from Buffalo, um, but they moved to Tampa as well because it is such an amazing scene, and it was regarded as like the sort of kind of birthplace of death metal, and it's incredible, really, all the, the musicianship and all, all the all the death metal bands that came from there. It's absolutely, it's almost legendary, like you know, it's just fantastic. So, yeah, it's a simple T-shirt. It's just got the logo on, but it's so good. It's just sort of just makes an impact. I love it. I love it so much. Um, I like the green on it, and, and that that's just fantastic. I just love it. And then on the back, you've got the tour dates. 
um, what does it say? European Tour 2018 look, and uh, there's a fair few UK dates, Dublin, London, Cardiff, Birmingham, that's where I saw them, and then Newcastle, which was three days later, so I saw them three times, um, twice in three, de- three days, sorry, and then Glasgow, and then th- these are uh, where we got Germany and Spain and uh, other places where else we got Denmark and that, so, so yeah, quality. Um, when I also saw them at Bloodstock, I got John Tardy, because John Tardy, I think he's so great. He's one of my heroes, you know, he's fantastic. This is my denim jacket, which has got patches on it, which I won't show you yet. But I will show you another time. But i got my obituary, classic, slowly we rot, which is just, like, phenomenal. I love it. And that's just a great album. So good. So heavy. It's just incredible. It's so good. So good. So good death metal. It's just like, I just can't put it into words really. What, what it means to me. What they mean to me either. Because they're such a great band. But, um, John Tardy's signature. I got that signed on my obituary patch. Which is, which is great. I'm so proud of that. I love it. I love it. So, um, I'll, I will do a video on this. On my, on my jacket. I'll show you all the patches on that. And talk about that. So yeah, today's obituary. Anyway, have a good day. See you all. Bye.